Hey guys, since I just took a shower, that's why I have no makeup on, um, and I just had to do this, so I thought I would show you how to make an improvised shower cap with a plastic bag. Because I don't have a shower cap here, and since I just got some low lights put in, as you may or may not know, um, then I try not to wash my hair for as long as possible once I get it dyed, just to let like, the natural oils get back and sink into my hair and everything try and be a little, you know, healthier than it already isn't. So, anyways, I don't have a hairnet here and I really needed a shower just because I felt kind of gross and I didn't want to wash my hair. So I thought I would show you the neat way I found how to make a plastic bag into a shower cap because I tried before and it didn't work out and then I tried this way and it worked really well. So, first thing you're going to need are some bobby pins. Um, I have these ones. I just got them out of my hair after I had my hair done for prom and so... I have these, and the first thing you're going to want to do is just pin any hair back that is in your face or around your ears. So do that. It looks so pretty. So since I got my hair cut and now have a bob, I really short in the back so I don't have to do any pinning back there. If you have long hair, I don't know if this will work as well for you, but if you have longer hair, I would just suggest like, um, you know, pinning it up or putting it into like a bun or something, somehow pinning that up. Anyways, take your plastic bag, make sure there are no holes in it because that would not work well for you. My hair looks like such a hot mess right now. Anyways, put the bag on your head. This is really loud. And just kind of like place it where you would want it to go where your hairline is. I would put it a little below your hairline just so that the water can hit it and roll off. And then cover your ears because you have all that hair around your ears. And then just gather the mass of it in the back like this. Kind of like you have a ponytail with the plastic bag. And once you have the mass gathered, do any adjusting that you need done like this, whatever. Then twist it, I'll turn so you can see what I'm doing, then you're going to want to twist this like this and then just tuck it under. It's going to get really tight right here, but that's what's holding it on. Then pull it down a little in the front or around your ears or wherever you need to. And this is going to feel, if you did it right, it should feel really tight. It should look like this in the back. And it's like, yeah, adjust it as you need, but it's not going to come off and it's going to stay that way. Do any extra pinnings of little hairs that you need to and then you can hop in the shower and I just did this today and as you can tell my hair is totally and completely dry. I didn't use a hair dryer. I haven't even like straightened it to make it look nicer than it kind of does right now but as you can tell it worked pretty well and so that is how to make a shower cap with a plastic bag and a few bobby pins for your hair. You don't need a hair tie, just twist it back. So I hope this was helpful to anyone who watched it, and I'm going to go outside and read in the sun now because it's sunny out. I'll see you guys later. Bye.